What's up? This is true. Just came through uh, to bring something to your attention concerning what dog had around him and then get the hell off of here. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, well, first of all, I salute to everybody. Got mad love for all those who got mad love for me. And, uh, you know, in a crazy twist of events, I got love for motherfuckers that ain't got love for me because that's the godly way. But that being said, let me tell y'all a little story. It's all it is, story time with True. Dolph, all right, Pete, long live, flipper man, kicking ass. It's, they can't kill your spirit, they can only kill your flesh. For all y'all that don't know that. First, let me, let me, let me, let me spit out three names. Let me, let me, let me spit out three nine. I'm stuttering three times for three nine. I ain't that a bitch. But, uh, Key Glock, Money Bag Yo, Black Youngster. What does all three of these guys, what do all three of these guys have in common? They all claim the same set, which is the Traveling Vice Lord. Now we're gonna have to put a little uh, hyphen and put Black Youngster to the side of one or three because he switched sides. Transformers, more than meets the eye. That's what they used to call niggas that flip, flip games back in the days, Transformers. Well, Black Youngster was affiliated with TVL. Then he transformed and flipped sides. So they still fucked up about that. But, uh, I, that, the reason why I'm bringing it to your attention is because this is what Dog had around him. And I ain't even finished yet. This is the first half. So, Key Glock, Black Youngster, and Money Bag Yo. We're just going to put Black Youngster in there for the time being. TVA, a traveling rights laws. This is that gang. This is the gang that they claim. Well documented, so uh, it ain't like nobody don't know. So, so y'all sit y'all ass down. So all of them claim Vice Lord, right? Now, let's pick two of them apart. Key Glock and Money Bag Yo. Now we all know Black Young saying uh, Money Bag Yo used to roll together. For y'all for, for y'all that didn't know that, yep, Money Bag Yo and Black Young say even got songs together, was real tight. Have they ever stopped being untight? We gonna get to that in a minute. I just want y'all to know that. They got songs together. They, 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 Black Youngster put, brought Money Bag Yo in the game with, uh, with Got It, as a matter of fact. This is documented. So back to the story about this gang gang shit that Dog had around him. Now, if all three of these, if Key Glock and Money Bag Yo are from the same gang, wouldn't that tell you how did, wouldn't, that, wouldn't that make you want to ask the question, can you uh, betray your gang in the same city just because just because one on this side and one on that side? Is that possible? I'm not a gang member, uh, so I already don't know the rules, <laughs> but I know common sense will tell me your loyalty is going to have to lie inside the gang that you uh, got jumped in or bought your way in or However the fuck you got in, unless something changed from back in the 90s when there were just GDs and, and vice lords in, in the city of Memphis and LMG, for those, for those of y'all didn't know. But so I asked that question because we seen Money Bag Yo and uh, Key Glock at a Grizzly game like 20 feet apart in the, <laughs> in the middle of Dolph Dead and they look like they best buddies, right? We ain't had no fallout after they after the game ended or none of that shit. Like they came together, they left together. So that's the reason why I'm asking this question because this is what Dolph had around him. What's the loyalty on Key Glock, Key Glock side stronger to Dolph or was it stronger to Money Bag Yo and the gang gang? Cause, it's, cause, Cause when the government come in and want you dead too, these are the elements they're gonna use to take you out so they can cover they self. They're gonna use what's around you to destroy you. That's just the game they've been playing for many, 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 many years, you know? So that's one side of it. Now let's go to the other side of this gang gang shit. I'm gonna get the hell on out of here. Uh, Truly Mafia. 
Was they or was they not on both sides? Did Dom have true La Mafia niggas around him? Cause we know uh, the big head motherfucker got it and his brother Jill and our man quit pretty much had true La Mafia on their side for sure. Now we know he got brought in straight drop on Dom's side from Trula. So, it seemed like the walls, Dolph was surrounded by a circle of motherfuckers that had more loyalty to, to each other than, than to him. And by them being all young niggas, that seemed like that's, a, that's some shit that should that'd be hard to maneuver out of, right? That's all I'm bringing to your attention. So when, when the conspiracy shit come in, uh, not really no conspiracy because we know how the government get down. They will use the same shit uh, to take you out. And that's exactly what I think going on. So with that being said, what's next? Well, I'm, I'm making a video right now, big dog. I'm making a video right now, though. I'm making a video right now, though. But you can come on, creep up right quick. What's up, Wiz? What's up, dude? What's up? Alright. Uh, uh, yeah, so uh like I was saying, that's what he had around him. So that's 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 what I wanna bring y'all attention. Y'all answer the question. You know what I'm saying? Because we know it's something bigger going on behind the scenes that we can't even fathom yet. Department of Justice is in is in town, like they know something. And this is the question I brought to y'all because to me, as I was thinking about it, you know what I'm saying? When you be loving dogs and shit, missing them and shit, man, like, it's hard. It's, it's, it's just ain't no way around it until, until, at least until I'm satisfied. I'm going to do all I can do in every way. But one thing I would not do is start watering shit down. I would not be watering shit down at this point in the game. It's just time for the, all the fucking conspiracy shit to go and be clipped. Nigga making too many goddamn videos all day, every day with regurgitated shit. You know what I'm saying? That shit don't even matter. You know what I'm saying? Unless it matter. Can't even stop none of these niggas, but you know what I'm saying? Can't afford for this shit to be watered down. It's time for everybody, man. Point the facts out, let go. Bring this shit to a close and let, 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 the, uh, let the DOJ and the system take care of the rest. Cause the streets gonna clean up what need to be cleaned up in Memphis for sure, for sure. I know that for sure. So that's all true kind to say, you know what I'm saying? I'm uh, in a great mood though. Once again, y'all already know what I'm finna say. It's your birthday. Bought that motherfucking uh, 50 cent in a couple of days. So that's all I kind to say, y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's a little light mood night. You know what I'm saying? Feeling good, I'm straight though. Um, what else? I had a, an announcement to make, but I'd rather show y'all, you know what I'm saying? Because on some way known, uh, one more piece of information come in, then I'm going to take y'all way back to what I've been trying to subliminally show y'all as, since y'all thought it was a game. Take it back to this Texas tag and who, who gave me the drop on it. And then I bet y'all open y'all ass up like some smelling salt since y'all thought it was a game for all these months. Oh, that taste of tag was real. Didn't know what, what it meant because you could never trace it because it was stolen. It was stolen. But now I know where it was stolen from. So it's making a lot of sense as the months go by. But what's going to make more sense is who the fuck gave me the drop or where to go look for it. Yeah, that's going to blow your mind. So y'all brace yourself for that. Uh, before I go, salute to everybody. Everybody that's been giving me early birthday wishes. Everybody that's been supporting me, supportive. Everybody that cares and gives a damn about my safety, my mental, you know what I'm saying, my health, my tooth, <laughs> and all that good shit, man. That's love. You know you love when 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 you can feel it 
and you ain't never got to, who, whoever told y'all you had to physically meet somebody to feel some love, that's a bullshit that lie. Because I got family members that just because they blood, I can't stand ass. You know what I'm saying? I don't love them run that goddamn deep. Lawyers they do though. So salute to everybody, man. You know what I'm saying? It's been a long journey. And um, uh, you know, for anybody that ain't uh taking advantage, if you've been your civil rights have been violated, I'm gonna leave the link to the Department of Justice while they in town. If you're from Memphis, Chicago, Minnesota, and a couple of more cities, then you can take advantage of this link. If you feel like you have been pulled over, harassed, uh, fucking physically assaulted, they pulled you over for a tent, search your car, you got a charge, hit that link, and uh, the first road you're gonna see is uh, submit a complaint. Tap on that. And it's a real simple form, tell them what happened, put in your name, your email address, and then, boom, boom, they gonna get back to you. So now's the time where numbers gonna matter while they're in town investigating. And maybe you can get rid of some of these charges that they, since they violate your, your uh, civil rights, your constitutional rights, we can clean up the city and you can get some wrong, you can right some wrong doing. And that's just free game from true result. Like, share, subscribe, I always support. Uh, I'm a holly child lay down. I love y'all, true.